Uh, good morning and uh, welcome to another edition of the uh, Atmo Show. Uh, it's Saturday and uh, we're at Brown Engineering. And uh, they are quickly going to take us through their stand, explain what they do, and uh, we can see uh, what they have to offer you. Uh, so uh, come and tour of us. Uh, good morning, Alistair. Thank you for talking to us. It's a pleasure. Thank you for coming through. Uh, can you quickly just uh, take us through what you have here, especially on the tobacco and the, and the agri site, and then when the, we'll go to the sure. agriculture after that, or the, uh, your other stuff? No, great. Well, thanks for coming through. Yeah, so um, just very quickly, Brown Engineering, yeah, we've sort of been around since 1976. I've been in the tobacco industry, mostly to uh, agri sector, tobacco sector more specific um, for, for many years uh, since the company started. And yeah, basically we do a broad range of uh, uh, sort of uh, tobacco handling and curing equipment um, from, uh, and we basically follow the process right through. So if you have a look at that, that um, uh, sort of, uh, uh, yeah, if you have a look there. Yeah, so basically what our concept is, is that we take it from land um, uh, through the whole system. It's picked in the land, it's reaped into special clips on our trailers, put onto our custom trailers. They then go to the tobacco curing facilities, um, uh, which we'll show you a bit more of over there on that side. And uh, basically our, our process uh, cures the tobacco and then it goes through grading and baling and packing and right. Uh, so our system caters from, from field to floor, to the so sales floor. That's a yeah. That is to get, get rid of the small stuff? Or ba waste yeah, them? basically this is baling um, uh, boxes that you see here. We do the press range as well. So um, tobacco baling press is there. Um, uh, it's electric press, there's economy press, which is a hand press. Um, and basically, yeah, the way bridges, etc., little bell way bridges. Um, and yeah, our system runs it all through. That's uh, scrap handling, um, etc. And uh, and then yeah, onto the curing facilities. So let's go look at the curing. Oh, so basically, that is an example of what a tobacco curing uh, tunnel looks like. That's what we refer to as a tunnel. And um, yeah, I mean you can see from there we do tunnels from 10 hectares to 120 hectares, um, various configurations. But that gives you an idea of what the tunnel does. So uh, that tractor we talked about just now will drop off um, at this facility. It will go through that facility and cured tobacco comes out the other side. Um, so yeah, that's a bit bit on, on tunnels, etc. Um, so basically, on on uh, the heat heat sources and heat exchangers, um, our company manufactures a range of, um, of products here. Starting off on that side, we've got dry heat exchangers. Um, that's a dry process; doesn't obviously um, have have water involved with it. Um, this also uh, tobacco curing, grain handling. Um, you know, we have various applications for these heat sources. Um, looking here, this machine here is a coal a coal stoker, um, which obviously uh, part of the heat source as well. And then also um, pressure um, pressure vessels, boilers. Um, uh, we have boilers and kettles in that range. Some are high pressure um, uh, steam. Um, others are just boilers, which are much uh, kettles, which are much lower temperature heat source system. Um, so a little bit on that um, radiators, etc. We've been doing these products for many years. A um, bit of an overview on, on that. How side. many years have you been in the business? So our business started off um, in 1976. The founder, Straff Brown, um, started the business. Um, his son. Uh, Andrew Brown uh, took over that business um, um, from him and, um, and then in 2016 um, uh, Alistair Stoll took it over from Andrew and um, so yeah it's, 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 a, it's a great brand that's been around for a little bit and um, yeah it started off with making tobacco clips wire products and we still make that product today um, so yeah it's a bit, bit about the agri side and, and history on, okay, on that side. Okay, take a look at some of sure. your structures, yeah. okay. what else you can do. Sure. So this is not just farming so these structures can go up for uh, yeah. Or any yeah. Plant so or give you a bit of an overview of some of the work on that side. So basically, yeah. I mean, you can see here pre-engineered structures. We do a range of stuff. Um, so the structure you see here today is a, is a more a, um, a agri application, basic farm shed. Um, but on uh, in terms of commercial structures, um, we have a commercial structures division as well, which produces um, you know bigger portal frames, taper framed um, uh, buildings, um, steel buildings. Um, and yeah, we have the regional focus on that. And um, so a little bit on that there. Um, yeah. Trolleys. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah. So tobacco trolleys, but that um, obviously part of our range of stuff. Okay. Yes, sir. Is it on? Yeah. yeah. So basically, um, also we've got a, a, a with heat sources etc. Come a range of fans and and that to push air. Um, and we've built fans for many years as well. Um, certain imported components, um, pumps, etc., which are part of our, our boiler and heat source applications uh, to pump water around, etc. 
So yeah, we've got um, in all part of our, our, our system. Thank you very much, John. Sure. Sure. And I hope to see you again. All right. Thank you so much for passing through. Cheers. Cheers.